Are you ready to film with me? Oh, don't you try and get out of there. <laughs> Jackson, you are not getting out of there. Hey guys, I wanted to jump on and give you guys just a quick update on what I have been doing as far as Cradle Cap goes with Jackson. I was having a conversation with my sister and her little girl has Cradle Cap and she can't quite seem to keep on top of it. So I was telling her what I do with Jackson and I thought I might as well tell you guys as well in case any of you guys are having issues with Cradle Cap. So with Jackson, I don't use soap on Jackson's scalp anymore when he was first born, I would wash his hair with just this little scrub brush and I would use typical baby wash. But he started getting cradle cap, his scalp started to get dry. And so now I just wash his hair with coconut oil. Right before his bath, I'll take the coconut oil and I'll just put it all over his head. And then once he's in the bath water, I'll take my little scrub brush and just scrub his hair like normal. And his scalp has done really well, but occasionally he'll still get little spots around his head with a little bit of cradle cap. And so what I do for that is throughout the day, I'll have just a little container of coconut oil and I'll dip a Q-tip in. And then I'll like three times a day, I'll just lightly put the coconut oil on where his cradle cap is. That way throughout the day it's staying moisturized and it's not drying out anymore. And I feel like it's really helped me and Jackson has a little bit of cradle cap still left on the back of his head. It's not very bad at all. I've been able to keep up on it and now that it's almost gone I'm now using regular soap and washing his hair like that and then throughout the day I'll lightly put a little coconut oil on it if it's bad. So that's my update, that's what I do with Jackson, but if your guys' kids have longer hair, Jackson's hair is short, so his hair isn't gonna get greasy throughout the day by me using and washing his hair in coconut oil. So if Jackson had longer hair, or like my sister, her little girl has longer hair, what I would do is I would put coconut oil all over the scalp and let it sit for about 20 minutes before I actually wash his hair and then I would wash the hair with regular baby shampoo. Are you trying to get out again? And then I would wash the hair with regular shampoo. That way the coconut oil is still on the scalp and it's moisturizing the scalp, but the shampoo is washing the hair so it's not so greasy. So you could do that and then if they have long hair as well throughout the day, you could take a little Q-tip and separate the long hair and kind of put it on the scalp a little bit to try and keep up on the cradle cap. So that's just what I would do. That's what I've been doing with Jackson. If any of you guys have any tips on what you do as far as cradle cap goes, make sure to comment down below because this may not work for everybody. It just works for me. That way if people are watching this and it doesn't work for them, they have other options to do. And I'm kind of curious to see what else other people do. This is just what my mom told me to do and it's worked so far. So that is all. I think Jackson's ready to get out of this bumbo. Has he been stretching out and trying to get out a million times? <laughs> he doesn't really like it very much. So I'm gonna go put him down for a nap. If you guys liked the video, make sure to thumbs up, and I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.